So roads are clearer today than they have been, but this is short lived. It is short lived. <laughs> Say it ain't snow. We got more snow on the way. That's good. Yeah, we got uh, this time around. It's going to be a bit heavier than the last uh, few rounds, especially for our southern spots. But again, as we head on into tonight, we'll look for the snow to pick up. Let's go right to your snow timeline and we'll break this down for you by 6 p.m. to midnight. That's the time frame when the snow is going to be arriving across southeastern Wisconsin a little bit sooner for our southwestern spots and a little bit later for our northern spots. I think here in Milwaukee around 8, 9 o'clock, we'll look for the snow to pick up by mid night and into 6 a.m. tomorrow morning. That's when we'll see the heaviest of snow during that time frame, about two to four inches, depending on where you are. Lighter amounts north, heavier amounts to the south. Now, as we head through the morning hours tomorrow, snow will continue for some. I think it really tapers off, though, north of Milwaukee. Southern end of Milwaukee and southern counties could see up to three more inches of snow. And by noon into 6 p.m., snow ends for almost everybody, except for along the lakeshore. We're going to look for possibly a little bit of a lake effect uh, snow that could bump the snow, snow totals up uh, lakeside as we head into the afternoon. OK, here's a live look at downtown Milwaukee, getting some sunshine this early afternoon. Enjoy it while we have it. 19 degrees, the current temperature in Milwaukee winds out of the west at 11 miles per hour currently across southeastern Wisconsin. Uh, temperatures are in the teens, another colder than average day. The average highs in the lower 30s and we're way behind that. 16 in Waukesha, 14 currently in West Bend. <clears throat> Excuse me, Storm 4 Max radar, southeastern Wisconsin. All is quiet. Let's widen the view here. You can see the snow extending all the way back towards Montana, South Dakota, and Iowa. This is all going to track in our direction. The heaviest of snow probably bypassing us just to the south across northern Illinois. Future forecast as we step on into the afternoon and evening. This is 5 o'clock. Your afternoon commute should still be dry here in southeastern Wisconsin, but snow not too far off. Look at the snow spread across the area by 9 o'clock. And then as we head on to the morning hours, uh, 2.38. AM snowing pretty good here and again 530 in the morning still snowing here in southeastern Wisconsin and by 11 o'clock I think the snow is starting to wind down except for a bit of lake effect snow could be possible and snow not too far off across northern Illinois by then and then on Saturday we'll keep an eye on this area of low pressure could bring some light snow to the area on Saturday. OK, as far as the snow forecast, the most important map we got here as we head into tonight and tomorrow it looks like six to eight inches of snow for our southern spots down towards Racine and Kenosha four to six inches for Milwaukee and Washington and then the totals go down the farther north you go. Weather alerts as we head into uh, this afternoon and evening 9 p.m. Winter storm warning goes into effect for the pink counties. The winter weather advisory for the adjacent counties in the purple here, Dodge, Washington and Ozaukee counties. Your forecast for today. High temperature of 22, mostly cloudy skies for tonight. Low temperature that falls down to 18 tonight. Snow develops again around 8, 9 o'clock for most of us tonight. Heavier amounts to the south. Here's your seven day forecast. Snow continues on Friday. 24 degrees on Friday. Again, the bulk of the snow during the morning hours. Maybe some lake effect lingering through the day. Light snow on Saturday, 22. 25 on Sunday, partly cloudy skies. And then we start to warm up next week, Monday, 30 degrees. Slight chance of a snow shower on Tuesday and into Wednesday with a temperature all the way up to 36 degrees. Vincent Elise.